spring is flying by in Michigan. The ground that was bare and frozen just a few short weeks ago is now green and teeming with life. Jason Brown has been calling in turkeys and capturing the kills of his friends and family all season long. Today, he's working behind an Avian X strutter decoy. The crew is named Petey. His lifelong friend Shad Woodruff is taking his turn behind the shotgun. Lifelike action Jason is giving to Petey, combined with a series of velvet smooth yelps, has caught the attention of the biggest tom in the field. Good afternoon. <laughs> Petey again. Oh boy, Petey's now five for five. Oh boy, oh, sweet Petey, five for five this year. Yeah, I had to kill him. <laughs> Self defense. <laughs> I had to protect once, my buddy. Once he got to, uh, once he got into twenty yards, he was in. It's done. He was coming. It's done. I mean, Neff and I were stuck. Yeah. I was starting to go yeah. like this. You can. Pro you probably could have stood up. That's how. That's how I mean, the moment he was. Did you see how bad I was moving? Right there, I mean, he is. He doesn't matter. He's four yards. And I, I had to move up like this. Yeah. Nice, man. Last, one last. of the last couple days of season. Again. Petey, this guy right here, he's killed probably five birds for us this year. He's a jerk. <laughs> he is. Three year old. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Beard Thomas. Pretty good beard. Yeah. Real good beard, actually. Yeah, that's a good bird. When the hens aren't with them, it can be July, and you can call them. Especially when you have Petey on your side. Petey has a track record of bringing birds on a bee line to the barrel. Casey Kiefer engaged Petey on an early season hunt in 2014. After Casey worked a box call to locate the birds, Petey hit the field put on a dance for the local gobblers. The rest is history. A loud blast in the woods acts as a signal for the rest of the party to meet up and share in the success of the hunt. Bird down. What do you got? Huh? Man, that was kind of a cluster. There's so many birds out there. I'll go grab this bird and figure this out. You know, yeah. Look at his beard all frozen off. Two-year-old bird. And this guy succumbed to Petey, as I've aptly named him. 
the rivalry between the brothers momentarily subsides to celebrate. Every time it all comes together for one of them, the glory is shared with the other. The spring sun is shining over Michigan, and brothers Chris and Casey Kiefer have spent the past few weeks chasing wild gobblers. Today, they are giving their good friend Jason a chance to tag a turkey for himself with the help of the brothers and their trusted pal, Petey. We've gained about three, 400 yards. We're in this low ditch. Another 100, 150 will pop up. We'll bring Petey up and we'll go right at him. Try and sneak one into the field in the corner of this ditch here. See if we can suck him in with Petey. He's a big bird out there. The guys are using the cover of a deep irrigation ditch to sneak into position. They're looking for the perfect place to deploy Petey. He's right there. 100 yards. Bring Petey. <laughs> what? That was awesome. Look at that. Get down, get down, get down. Get down. Alright, so we've got Petey here. He's our go to in field situations. And this morning we had a tough setup. We had a, a lone gobbler in a tree. He flew to hens. We've been hunting this bird for a week now. This big gobbler. I'd hate to think he's got more. He's, got, he's a big bird. Oh, yeah. Did you see that fan when he was coming in? Just ooh. Oh yeah, he's a big bird. And uh, we crawled this ditch line, probably a half mile, and popped up right here, put Petey up. Petey worked, huh? Petey did it, Petey dude. Worked. We walked that ditch long enough to get me sweaty. <laughs> Good Lord, <laughs> Lord. Good hooks. Yeah. Big old beard. Gotcha. Three-year-old. Oh. Yeah. He couldn't resist. Look at that. Look at that from here. Look at that. Look at that from here. That is unbelievable. Yeah, we. Uh, this is our. I don't know. Probably fifteenth day in a row getting up at yeah. four thirty. Oh, that's fun though. You know, it's the chance we we hunt so much together in the in the deer woods and and you know running the mountains up north the north country and you know to get a chance to hunt in our home ground you know five miles from our homes yeah. to be able to come out in these fields and hunt these birds and really I've you know I've hunted everywhere you've hunted turkeys everywhere it doesn't get any better yeah it doesn't it just doesn't get any better. Another spring turkey season has come and gone. It's getting cold. Brothers Chris and Casey Kiefer have punched tags for themselves and Sky helped friends and family raining. do the same. Soon the cool mornings and early sunsets will give way to the dog days of summer. The heavy summer air will forfeit to the rut-fueled fall. 
In the meantime, Chris and Casey will take every chance they get to spark the rivalry between them. Let the lightning strike. They'll miss no opportunity to pass their traditions on to the next generation. Their hunger for the hunt is satisfied by their success in the turkey woods. But the contentment will likely be short-lived. The drive to search for big game from a tree stand has already begun to stiffen its grip. <laughs>